appointment to see. Life without you been feeling kind of strange. Well, I see that you're doing very well. Ha, you looking very well. I miss the way your perfume smell. I miss the way that you blow up my line just to make sure that I'm feeling well. Hey y'all. So today we're vlogging. Do I want to have this on off? I think I want to have it off. If I'm being completely honest, today it was really hard to get out of bed. Like it felt like me and my bed was glued together. But we have a couple of things to do today. So I had no choice but to get the hell up. And I'm just about to do my morning routine, which is just wash my face. I think I'm gonna shower and then um, brush my teeth, of course. And then we're gonna get dressed. You guys are gonna see what we're doing today. Y'all gonna be kind of surprised, but I don't know. Y'all might be surprised, might not be surprised. People always emailing me all throughout the day, but yeah, I gotta get myself ready. I don't have on a wig. My hair is still braided down, so we gotta do all of that. But first things first, I gotta take care of this breath and these teeth. I think I wanna wash my face after the shower or maybe in the shower because I be sweating in the shower. So I don't wanna go ahead and wash my face and then I feel, you know, icky and yucky. Cause I like my water to be real hot in the shower. So I be sweating a little bit. Do y'all see my skin? Like what? It is so bad and I think it's hormonal because like this side I haven't been breaking out much but like over here it's just going crazy. I haven't changed anything that I sleep on. I haven't changed my laundry detergent. Stress maybe. But I drink nothing but water so it's like I don't know what's going on but normally I break out right in this area and I think that is hormonal so whatever. I'm about to go ahead and get in the shower wash my ass and then I'm gonna talk to you guys when I get out Ooh, that felt so good where's my towel what time is it it is 1 37 so I got like I have like an hour and all to get ready completely I'm just washing my face with Cetaphil daily cleanser up and I smell so good so now it's time to pick out my outfit I think I just want to wear these sweatpants they're just army green and then this cropped hoodie type situation I just want a simple outfit because it's cold outside but it also has the potential to get hot I think this is just like the safest option but I don't know which shoes I'm gonna wear yet because that's probably gonna depend on the jury that I choose so I'm gonna go ahead and put these on and then I'll come right back So now we're in the beauty room and it's time to do my hair. The wig that I'm gonna be putting on today was provided to me by Love Me Hair and they were so nice and so sweet. I've been dying to try out this hair because I've seen so many advertisements, so many videos and I just had to see for myself. But I'm gonna show you guys everything they sent me. They sent me some lashes. Oh, these are nails. They sent me some nails. Oh, this kind of match with my outfit today. They sent me a gold scrunchie. They sent me some small hoop earrings and they're like blinged out. Definitely gonna wear those. And I'm not sure what this is. Oh, I think this goes on the back of your phone maybe. If y'all know what this is, let me know because I don't know what this is. But they sent this as well. I kind of already love this unit. I've customized it already, plucked it, bleached it, nice, everything. And I think I'm going to wear this as a glueless unit because honestly, y'all, I told y'all already, I ain't even want to get out of bed. I think that'll just be an easier situation for today. So I'm just going to slip this on my head. Oh, Lord. Oh, it already look laid. Hold on. It is a little bit too snug for my head. But we can work around that. I've had this issue so many times. Apparently my head is big. So it's like I said, I don't think I'm gonna glue this unit down. I'm just going to spray it down if that makes sense. But y'all can't even see the lace. Like what? What? Yeah, I don't know. This is definitely giving glueless. So 
that's what I'm gonna do. First thing I'm gonna do is just clip this hair away. Y'all see, this is how you know if the unit's too small for your head. If you got a tug on it for it to sit where it needs to sit, then it's probably nine times out of 10 too small. I'm still gonna have to cut out my ear holes. So I'm just gonna take a comb, part where my ear is, separate that hair so you don't cut any of it, and then like that. So now you should be able to pull your ears out with no problem. It doesn't even look like, you wouldn't even be able to tell, like if I cover this up, like if I just did this, you would literally not be able to tell the difference between the lace and my skin. I'm like so glad that lace technology is getting better and better because honestly, like in a couple of years, what the hell is gonna be the point of even doing your hair? Like what? This is like so convenient, like too convenient that it scares me. This is Even Wonder Lace Adhesive Spray. And I'm just gonna spray this. Ooh, this stuff is cold. And I'm just gonna place this all around the lace. Now I'm just gonna take my blow dryer on cool and just go ahead and dry this up. Okay, so I think it's dry. Yep, definitely dry. So I'm just gonna push this back right quick. Now I'm just gonna cut the lace. now I'm about to spray some more of this and then reapply my elastic band and then we'll be completely done and while that's drying I'm about to just go ahead and wet down the hair a little bit just so y'all can see the curl pattern when it's wet and as y'all can see like when it gets dry it gets pretty big I love when the units are versatile like that and you can wear them slick or you can wear them poofy I really like that because it really remind it reminds me of like my natural hair. I'm just gonna finger detangle. I'm able to do this pretty easy, so this is some really good hair and it's not shedding like what. And then I'm gonna take some mousse, just a little bit, and I'm just gonna apply this to the hair. I'm really trying to hurry up, y'all, because I got somewhere to be at three o'clock and it is. 215 and I have not ate yet and I don't want to be snappy and you know stuff with the people so I need to hurry up so I can go get me some food or at least get me some like Starbucks or something before I go because I am so hungry like I need to eat something this is exactly how I wanted to wear it. it's not fully dry but you know it's dry enough so now y'all yeah, hate when hair gets everywhere okay now I'm just gonna remove this elastic band so, do y'all see this hairline on this wig? Like, what? What? Yeah, this is definitely my hair. If anybody asks, yes, this is my hair. How did I grow it? I don't know, drinking water. All right, y'all, so that was my hair. It probably took me like 15, 20 minutes to do my hair. I ain't too much mad at it, but I need to do a little bit something to my face because I am about to be in front of people. It's 2.20, so I'm gonna give myself 10 minutes to do that and then right after that y'all we gotta leave the house like dead ass like seriously spray on some perfume spray my hair i think i'm just going to put a little bit of foundation on and that's it and put on some mascara and call it a day honey because we don't got time like seriously don't got time i probably could put like a little bit of concealer right here definitely gonna wake up the eyes put a little wax on my eyebrows yes i put hair wax on my eyebrows because it keeps them in place all day some people put soap on their eyebrows so at this point i don't think there's no wrong that you can do i'm gonna set down my face and y'all, we gotta dig. 
like right now. Hairline still eating, even in bathroom. Like, don't play with it. But we gotta find shoes. I'm trying to think whether or not I wanna put on a jacket. So if I wear this. I don't know. I think I do want to wear a jacket because it is cold. But I just don't know if I want to wear this jacket. I don't know. Should I wear this one? I wish I could like talk to me in real time. I think I'm gonna put on this one and then these Converse. Cause I don't got no white forces right now, but I kind of want to put on white cause I don't got any other boots to put on that's green or gold i'm gonna have to go to white which is fine or i can just be bummy and put on my louis vuitton slides i don't mind having my feet out when it's cold like i always kind of have my toes out anyway because i wear nothing but ugg slides so this doesn't bother me i just need to see it in the mirror hold on okay i think i'm gonna go with the slides but if i'm gonna do the slides i gotta have on anklets because my little ankle is so skinny and it just be looking weird sometimes in slides. So I gotta put on some anklets and then we're gonna be ready to go. I'm ready to go. I got my purse, I got a lip gloss, I got my card. I think that's it. Let go y'all. Tweety clearly does not want me to leave. I'm gonna be right back, okay? I'm gonna be right back. I promise. I gotta come right. I'm gonna come back. I'm gonna come back. This is what I'm looking like. Hold on, let me fix my little long ass feet. I'll have all of my outfit details in the description box. But this is not major, just a chill fit. We just going to run some errands right quick and then we'll be right back at home, honey. Okay. Yo, I I'm about to be late. Okay, we gotta go for real, for real, for real, for real, for real, for real. Like, no more games. Y'all, I am so excited. Like, <laughs> they got some good news for you, girl. I'm gonna be so happy. That's just gonna turn my whole day around. Cause if I'm be honest, when I woke up this morning, like I told y'all, like I did not wanna get out of bed and like, it felt like the world was on my shoulders. Of course, good news always, you know, made things a little bit better. But I need to get there on time so they don't take your girl as a joke. Cause I'm dead ass. I'm dead ass B. I'm about to cut on some music so I can drive um faster. Okay, so y'all I'm here and now I just gotta find parking. Um, where do I want to park? I'm here. I'm excited. I'm a little bit late, so I got to run in there. So I probably will turn on my camera once I get, you know, seated and, you know, settled. But I just wanted to let you guys know I made it. It's like 3.07. No, it's 3.06. So I'm not like that late, but I'm late and I don't like being late because I feel like that just leaves a bad impression. So. Yeah, in a what it's like. Hello. Hi. How are you? I'm good. How are you? Good to see you. Good to see you. I'm jealous. <laughs> <laughs> it's a wig. Don't worry. Oh, it's beautiful. Thank you. Did you buy your retainer with you? Um, my clear ones? Yeah. No. I was supposed to bring them? Yeah. Oh, they no longer fit. My teeth have shifted so much. They are no longer. Oh, you're in trouble. Let's go and put some braces on. Too. Yeah. <laughs> Let me put this one here. And doctor is coming a few minutes to see you. Okay. Hey, how are you doing? I'm good. How are you? Um, they're just <laughs> not where they were before. They're so. not. Yeah. Are you still wearing retainers? I have the one permanent one on the bottom, but my other two doesn't. Oh. That's Fit they don't fit anymore. Yeah. Do you still have them or mm -hmm. no? I okay. still have them. Okay. Well, let me get some gloves and I'll check you out, okay? Okay. When did you get your braces off? Um, a couple years ago? Yeah, probably 2018 or 19. Okay. I think it was 2019. 2019? Yeah. So, basically, what they told me was great news. Um, if y'all have not already figured out where the hell I was at, 
I was at the orthodontist because I was considering getting braces again because my teeth have shifted since I got my braces off in 2019. Yeah, I think I got them off right before I graduated. So 2019 and my teeth have shifted because I never had a retainer on my top, like on my top teeth. So my top teeth have shifted. So I went to the appointment to see See, they need to fix up these roads because I shouldn't be feeling like I'm on a roller coaster and I'm just going down the street. Now what I have to do is go to a dentist so they can check the health of my teeth and then they'll be able to give me a treatment plan. But the good thing about it is they telling me that basically I may not have to get braces and that it's very minor, like my shift and my teeth is very minor. So they might can just fix it with basically Invisalign. So I'm kind of happy about that because honestly braces is not a fun experience because if you know, you know, if you don't, mm, first of all, it hurts. Second of all, it's expensive. Third of all, it hurts. You can't eat what you want to eat. Everything gets stuck in, stuck in your teeth. You have to like take special care of your mouth when you have braces in because it's metal in your mouth. Like it just be a whole lot. So I'm kind of glad that, you know, they're saying that I may not have to get braces again and I may could just do it with, you know, wearing my retainers and basically just like Invisalign. So I'm kind of happy about that. And I think that way it's going to be cheaper because now, of course, my parents won't be paying for it. It's going to be me paying for it. So the cheaper, the better. I'm so excited. I'm already like, I done already got my dentist appointment, everything set in place and yeah, we finna get this ball rolling. Cause I really like for my mouth and my teeth to look perfect. Like I'm not the one to go and get veneers. I, I wanna say never say never cause I really don't know what could happen to my mouth or what could happen to my teeth to where like, you know, I feel like I may have to get Invisalign. But I mean, not Invisalign, veneers. But for right now, I just don't see that happening for me. I wanna fix up my teeth. Like I want my teeth to be straight. I don't want chumples in my mouth. I want my teeth in my mouth and I just want them to be straight and yeah so so hopefully after my dentist appointment I'm able to go ahead and start my plan and your girl teeth can be back straight in no time. They also said that it shouldn't take too long like it's not going to take a long time for my teeth to go back to what it was. So I'm like so ecstatic right now like so happy right now like so happy right now but now it's time to get some food. Um, it's like four o'clock and I still haven't ate nothing. So I think I'm just about to stop at Zaxby's. I went through this whole little phase of like hating Zaxby's a lot. And then all of a sudden, that's like the only thing that I really be wanting. That Bojangles and Chick-fil-A, but like Chick-fil-A, I kind of just been trying to lay off because I overdo the Chick-fil-A. So I just, you know, I think Zaxby's is cool. So that's what I'm about to eat. It's kind of expensive, but it's okay like $12 for a meal for fast food is kind of expensive but it's whatever your girl gotta eat either way so it really don't matter so I'm just about to order my food so your girl can eat and then I gotta go pick up a package and then I think that's gonna be it for today my nails are already done my toes are done my hair is done my eyebrows they're not done but they also don't need to be done like there's nothing wrong with them. So I really don't got nothing else to do today. Probably just gonna go home, chill, probably edit up this vlog, answer some emails probably. I don't really have nothing else to do today, so. Yeah, I'm in the line, the line kinda long, so I'ma talk to y'all when I get my. So y'all, I am back at home, and today was a pretty successful day. I think, you know, I got a few things done which I feel really good about. The ending of my day did not reflect the beginning of my day, which is perfect. I just took some Tylenol because I was hurting a little bit. Um, just to update on that, I do feel basically the same that I felt when I made the video. I just have to, whenever I feel it coming on, I just go ahead and take some pain medication and then it just goes it kind of like goes away for a little bit so that's what i've been doing um other than that i'm probably about to sit here and answer some emails because it is now eight o'clock pretty much the majority of hair companies and stuff is overseas and you know their time is 
the literal opposite of our time. Dang, my, my forehead look really big in this angle. My forehead just looks so big right now. Anyways, um, our time is completely opposite of their time. So 8 a.m., I mean 8 p.m. is their 8 a.m. So they're about to start emailing me. I might as well just sit here and just try to get it all done before it gets too late. And then I'm like trying to stay up. Yeah, today was a pretty successful day. I will be updating you guys on whether or not, um, you know, I'll, I'll be updating you guys on my process of, you know, getting my teeth back perfect and, you know, all of that good stuff. So, y'all ain't got to be questioning your girl. I'm going to update y'all. I'm going to try to do a, a vlog, you know, occasionally so it keeps you guys updated. I'm trying to see if there's anything else that I have not caught you guys up on. I got my nails done. I don't know if y'all can see them. Oh, there they are. Let me make sure they're clean because they're white. Everything gets on white, but... I got my nails done and I actually had to go to two different nail salons because the first one that I went to, they did not shape my nails right at all. And she rushed, I don't even wanna talk about it. So then I had to go to another nail salon. Luckily there was, in, there was someone in there who understood that I wanted short, sharp square. And um, you know, he fixed up my nails and then painted them white. And I really, really like them. I already took off all my jewelry because I hate for stuff to be dangling on me when I get home. But nails done. I'm trying to see what else. I think that's it, y'all. I'm going to see you guys in the next video. Thank you so much, Love Me Hair, for sponsoring this video. This hair is completely gorgeous. I can't wait to take pictures in this hair. Yeah, it's just giving. And it's perfect for the weather because the weather is, like, confused right now. And this is, like, keeping me warm until spring comes all the way on. I just love some good curly hair, but thank you guys so much for continuing watching this video. If you've made it this far, you might as well go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Like, why not? And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!